Oh my god. What's this, Pimp My Ride? I guess, I guess. It looks like a 300ZX from the front. What is up guys, so today we're heading to the shop to continue working on the Miata. We gotta take the diff out, we gotta take the power plant frame out. Uh, we're gonna do a whole bunch of shit today. We still got a couple bushings to burn out. I'm bringing the SR there so I can put the ducktail on. I'm also going to get an inspection today at six, so hopefully we pass then. So definitely come along and enjoy this halfway decent day with us. It's so nice just to be able to hop in here and turn it on with the key without having to open the hatch and put the jump pack on, then hop back out, take the jump pack off, close the hatch. It's so nice, and I'm also glad that the battery fixed all the problems. Knock on wood, that uh, it stays that way, but we're gonna head off now, just waiting for Dylan to come down, and then Chow's gonna be with us. Uh, Orion's taking the truck. I'm pretty sure Damien's gonna meet us there, Tony Miranda. So it's gonna be a sick day, it's gonna be packed. We're gonna get lots done today, gonna be a very successful day, so it's gonna be mad. Quick stop at Advanced Auto, gonna grab some wheel studs, two of them for the back. Don't wanna take them out of my 240, so I might as well buy them here. They're like three bucks each. Two wheel studs and a bottle of Coke, only five bucks. So goddamn cheap, but now I'll finally have four lugs in the back. Goddamn, that thing spooled like hell. I know, but they're gonna be eBay. How was school skirts? The week? Oh, my, yeah. my skirts are eBay, they look great. Oh, I know. School is, it was hard. It was hard. It, I, I, school, they're, school. they're really, school honestly, school. They're, they're really making me work for my degree this semester. I saw that live stream of you in that chemical class or whatever. Oh, how funny was that? Is was that so your funny. lamp? Way too bright. Got the 240 backed up to the garage. I'm gonna do a couple things today. I gotta tighten the cap. I also gotta tighten the back bumper. As you kinda see, it's kinda flopping all around. And we got the ducktail we got off Mark yesterday. It is for an S14, so it's a bit long. You can see it overhangs from the hatch right there, so I can't drill in the, the way, way ends. I'm gonna have to drill in like right there. But we got the drill set up, got the extension cord out here. Got a bit on it. Just gotta find some self-tappers. Have everything besides self-tappers, so me and Dylan are gonna quickly run to Advanced Auto and pick up some self-tappers. I'm gonna go with these. Quantity of 12. Are those rivets? Uh, rivets? Yeah. Do they sell a box of self peppers? Probably not. No, but this we're gonna go with right here. These look like the, uh, they will suffice for what job we're doing. Got four holes drilled in the ducktail, four holes drilled in the trunk. Now we're gonna self tap it in. Dude, I fucking, mean, you that looks good. Tension on it. That looks really fun. Oh yeah, it does. Come back on black. Racks on racks on racks. Nope. Loosen yeah, this up. Loosen this up a little bit. Back it out like I. Alright, fuck it. That looks good, dude. Set. Uh, I knew it was gonna be cold. My battery is blinking red, so if the camera dies, I apologize, but my phone is charged. So if on the off chance it does die, I can record on my phone. It's either or, like my uh, either my camera's dead, and my phone is charged, or my phone is dead, and my camera's charged. Anyway, we finally got the rotor off of the hub. Very, very rusty. I tried to thread a bolt into the position to take it off, like it pops it off, there's one there, one there, but the bolt broke in it, so I just had to hit it with a hammer, but she's off. Old stud out, as you can see, I don't know if you can see actually, because I can't really focus it, but the threads are absolutely demolished, and we got the new ones right wherever I, wherever the, where did I put them? Right here. Here are the brand new ones, a dollar each. I'm gonna hammer these in, and I'll show you what it looks like when it's done. There we have it, brand new stud. Basically pulled all the way, but when I put the wheel back on and put the lug on, it'll pull it the rest of the way. So this side is done. Rotor back on, caliber back on, and then wheel back on. 
wheels are back on. Now all I have to do is find another keyed lug nut. Got a pressure washer as well. Nice. I have to find another keyed lug nut because these holes right here are really, really tiny. And uh, I have to find one that'll fit in there. And the only one that'll fit in there are the keyed ones. So got the wheel studs fixed. Got the cat tightened. Last thing I do is put on the bumper on. Cool and get it halfway, <laughs> halfway decently tight. So cool. not exactly. How should we do this? I don't know how to, just, know how to go about it. Just do the, the two corners again. And I'm so cold. And I'm <laughs> the bumper is finally secured. I wouldn't say properly, but it's definitely secure. A lot better than before. It's not just held by zip ties. We got a self tapper right there and a self tapper right there. Leaving for inspection in like 20 minutes, so we'll be, I think we'll be good. Thank God. When it was getting inspected, the guy took out the oil and checked the oil. It was a little low, so I picked up a nice bottle of Rotella T6 5W40. It was on sale, saved 11 bucks, only $19.99. So we're about to slap some of this in and take off and head back to the house because it's too cold to chill at the shop. It's too cold. The jack, Today, is, the jack is outside. The jack is outside. I'll put it back. They're going to head and what? pick up the trailer at Jimmy's house. Oh yeah, remember, so like, we're gonna be doing this tomorrow. I know Cam's gonna be filming it, Donovan's gonna be filming it, fucking Ryan's gonna be filming it, but now I gotta film it too, so. Well, make sure you go follow him. Follow me. It's right there. So, subscribe, subscribe to me, subscribe to me right here. It's, it's gonna be great, so. It's gonna be mad. You can catch up on my LS swap build, which I gotta finish, and uh, we're gonna be good. It's gonna be mad. All right, I'll catch you guys at the house.